The game of rock, paper, scissors sound, but one thing. So I can only win this game if I play paper. But say I beat you at rock or scissors, you'll lose too. So it ends up being a tie. Then what happens if they both play the same thing? In that case, it still ends up being a tie. But if you can play anything besides paper, you can actually win. So that's the trick. She said. It is. Even with these rules, if I just play rock, I have a two or three chance of winning. Same as scissors, also a two or three chance. But with paper, I only have a one or three chance to win. So, my best chance is throwing scissors or rock. Oh, but Lucy said he'd only play paper. That makes it more risky on my end to play rock, which is the only way he can win. In other words, he's trying to force me to play scissors. Did you really think I was stupid enough to fall for that? I'll crush your plans and play rock. Wait a minute. There's a two and three chance I'll win if I play rock. But there's also a one and three chance I'll lose. Unless he's totally lying he said he'd only play paper. So, if he does, then he'll risk a one in three chance of losing as well as a one in three chance of winning. But if he doesn't, we'll have a two in three chance of losing and absolutely no chance of winning. It's obvious. He's got to pick it. Paper. You ready? Here we go. Yeah, I'm ready. One. But I hope two, you're ready to lose. 